Computer vision is seeing an increasing number of industry applications, monitoring and managing crop yield in agriculture, annotating and pinpointing anomalies in healthcare, facilitating warehouse logistics and manufacturing, and safety and navigation for autonomous vehicles. But what is computer vision and why does it matter? Simply put, computer vision enables devices to use human-like vision capabilities. Broadly speaking, computer vision enables devices to perceive objects or patterns in images or video frames and uses that information for further analysis or decision-making using techniques like detection, classification, and segmentation. Computer vision can also help synthesize and generate new images and video, classify helmets for safety, segment parts of a road scene as drivable and non-drivable space, and even morph and adjust highly accurate, high-resolution images. Computer vision uses data trained on mathematical algorithms to analyze, interpret, and process images and video. Let's take classification for example. Computer vision-enabled devices take images like this one of Fido and analyze the photo's pixels to extract features and characterize the image to see if there's a dog in the photo or not, and if it is actually Fido himself or not, based on images previously given. Computer vision software helps people solve the most difficult challenges and supports everyday tasks, including identifying where a farmer needs to water his crops and protect against weeds, pinpointing where firefighters deploy to extinguish a fire, and identifying bottlenecks and how to improve production and packaging on an assembly line. Computer vision software is the enabling technology to solve many industry challenges. Whether you are new to the field of computer vision or an expert developer, NVIDIA has the computer vision software for you to start from scratch integrate and customize into your workflow, and scale for deployment. For more on computer vision software, check out NVIDIA's Computer Vision Solutions landing page in the link below.